In the keenly awaited 3,000 meter steeplechase, Britain at last had a fair chance of a gold medal in Welsh born John Ivor Disley. He took the water jump well, but delayed his final sprint too long. The great American Ashenfelter won in 8 minutes 45.4 seconds. Disley just failed to be second. The 400 meters was a triumph for Jamaica. Here again, the winner set a new Olympic record. The finish was a great struggle between Roden and his close pursuer, McKenley. Roden just won in 45.9 seconds. Now came the visitor everyone was waiting to see, the Duke of Edinburgh. For the time being, Helsinki's young ladies lost interest in events in the stadium. His Royal Highness was received by Lord Burley, conducted to the Presidential Palace, and loudly cheered there as he came onto the balcony, accompanied by the Duke of Kent. British hopes again fell sadly in the 1500 metres. We did hope that Roger Bannister might win the gold medal here, but it was not to be. Lug of Germany was just in front of Bartel Luxembourg on the last lap. Bartel broke the tape in 3 minutes 45.2 seconds, so overcome he wept. There was another Australian triumph in the women's 200 metres, and again it was Marjorie Jackson who won the gold medal, beating Miss Brauver of Holland and bettering the Olympic record set four years ago by Fanny Blanker's Kuhn. Time, 23.7 seconds. The Duke had a democratic meal in the canteen, no great hardship to one train in the Royal Navy, and was then fortified to watch the drama of the men's four 400 metres relay final. This was a grand win for Jamaica. Rodin received the baton from McKenley on the last handover and beat Whitfield of America to the tape. The Jamaican gold medalists were Wint, Laying, McKenley and Rodin. Sheila Lowell failed at 5 feet 5 and 3 quarters. Esther Brand of South Africa cleared that height and won the gold medal, Sheila having to be content with a silver one. We had yet another disappointment in the marathon. Cramped floor Jim Peters, who'd run splendidly for 20 miles. Zatopek, that amazing Czechoslovakian, was first home, making Olympic history by winning all three long-distance events. His feats are unlikely to be beaten for a long time to come. <laughs>